Hi, Tim Roberts, Application Engineer with Go Engineer. This quick tip video, I'm going to discuss a very simple plot option that can also be very effective. Flow Simulation has a lot of really nice options for plotting. Here we're looking at a cut plot. Let me hide that. Um, let's take it back to basics. Let's say we wanted um, just a simple XY line plot. Okay, so down here in our results, we can right mouse click and we can insert a new XY plot. And one of the things we need to define that plot, we either need a curve or an edge. Um, in this case, we don't have that geometry, so we're going to use a sketch, which can also be used. Okay, so I'm going to go down here and I'm going to select this sketch that's been drawn before, and I'm going to select the second sketch at this location. Okay, and the quantity I want to plot is going to be velocity. So I'll select the velocity, which is the magnitude, and we'll do a show. And right down here in the corner, you can see we have a very um, simple but nice, easy to read XY plot. Okay. So, one nice thing about an XY plot is it's really easy to export that to Excel just with the click of a mouse here. We can export our um, velocity versus uh, width in this case to Excel, and then that's what it looks like. Okay, real easy to do. Uh, seamless. Uh, let me close this. So that's maybe one of the most valuable reasons to use an XY plot other than the fact that it's simple and easy to read. So there are way more complicated plots. Uh, we can do trajectory plots and, and surface plots and all of that, but sometimes an XY plot presents as much information as you need to see. So hopefully you'll remember that. Hopefully you'll use that for your uh, project. Um, this is Tim Roberts, Go Engineer. Thanks for watching this quick tip video.